find the thevenin equivalent at terminals a b of the circuit in figure we have to find vth and rth of this circuit solution first of all we will redraw the circuit now to find rth to find rth we will short circuit the voltage source and open circuit the current source this will be open circuited because this is a current source and this will be short circuited because this is a voltage source and this will be rth so rth will be equal to rth is equal to this 20 ohm plus 10 ohm parallel with 40 ohm 10 ohm parallel with 40 ohm so this will be 20 plus this will be 10 into 40 divided by 10 plus 40 So twenty plus ten into forty divided by ten plus forty. So it is twenty-eight ohm. This is the value of RTH. Next, we have to find VTH. So to find VTH, to find vth let's assume this is node v1 and this is node v2 let's say this is reference node with zero voltage let's say this is current i1 this is current i2 and this is current i3 now we can apply nodal analysis here to find the value of v1 and v2 so apply kcl at node v1 so at node v1 kcl will be summation of all the entering current entering current at this node is i1 is equal to summation of all the leaving current leaving current is i2 plus i3 plus 3 I two plus I three plus three. This will be I one is equal to I one is forty minus V one by ten. Forty minus V one by ten is equal to I two. I two is V one minus zero by forty. V one minus zero by forty, then plus I three. I three is V one minus V two by twenty. V one minus V two by twenty plus three. So this will be forty by ten minus V one by ten. Minus V one by forty. This will be minus V one by twenty, and this will be plus V two by twenty. Then minus three is equal to zero. Now this will be minus one by ten. Minus one by forty. Minus one by twenty. Plus one by twenty. Not plus one twenty, because this is V two. Only minus one by ten. Minus one by forty. Minus one by twenty. 
this will be minus 7 by 4 t minus 7 by 4 t v1 and this will be 4 minus 3 will be plus 1 is equal to 0 plus v2 by 20 plus 1 is equal to 0 this will be minus 7 by 4 t v1 plus v2 by 20 is equal to minus 1 let's say this is equation number 1 now we will apply KCL at node v2 apply KCL at node v2 so entering current at this node is 3 plus I3 3 plus I3 is equal to leaving current leaving current at this node is 0 so this will be 0 so 3 plus I3 is I3 is V1 minus V2 by 20 V1 minus V2 by 20 is equal to 0 so this will be V1 by 20 minus V2 by 20 is equal to minus 3 let's say this is equation number 2 now solving equation 1 and 2 we get solving equation 1 and 2 we get mode 5 1 this will be minus 7 by 40 plus 1 by 1 by 20 minus 1 this will be 1 by 20 1 by 20 minus 1 by 20 minus 3 so v1 is equal to 32 volt and v2 is equal to 92 volt what we have to find we have to find VTH this will be VTH and VTH is equal to V2 VTH is equal to V2 VTH is equal to V2 therefore VTH is equal to 92 volt what we have to find we have to find Thevenin equivalent at terminals AB of the circuit so to find Thevenin equivalent circuit we need RTH this is the value of RTH 28 ohm and VTH VTH is 92 volt its th Thevenin equivalent circuit will be Thevenin's resistance in series with Thevenin's voltage this will be positive this will be negative this is terminal A and B so this is A this is B this is RTH which is equal to 28 ohm RTH is 28 ohm and this is VTH which is 92 volt For electrical and electronics engineering related questions and answers, visit the link in the description below.